Jay. Mm-hmm. Um, last couple of days, Ryan Garcia has been really, really active on social media. Uh, a lot of people is worried about his mental health going into the Devin Haney fight. A lot of people think it's not going to happen. Mm-hmm. Like, do you think Ryan's trolling? Or do you think that, you know, that Ryan's going through something? Like it's a little bit of both. Then I just looked at a video, right? He looked heavier in that video than he did when we saw him in New York. Mm. So I'm starting to think is some of these Jones pre premature. Like did he make these videos right before the tour? So mm. that it still look relevant and it's I mean it still look uh up to date and everything. You know what I mean? Cause sometimes you can see little shit where you can tell it's old. But it's just something about it. But if that's not the case and he tripping. I think, I mean, he was on the drone with Andrew Tate. He was tripping. He wasn't tripping, but he was saying some shit. And Andrew Tate was trying to tell him, like, yo, like, I mean, don't get too crazy. He like, I don't give a fuck. Like, fuck mm. that. You know what I mean? Now, what he talking about, I don't know, because I ain't never seen that. I, don't, I mean, I never had that laid out in front of me. But that's why I can't say he tripping. I'm going to stop saying he tripping. But I'm, I'm concerned because the fight might fall now. I mean, we don't want the fight to fall. You know what I mean? But... Being in the perfect health mentally wise, I don't know, man. And the shit looking crazy right now. I don't know where it's, what's going on. Like he don't look like he like he's super confident in the fight. He don't even really look like he focused on the fight. Then I saw something this morning. They gave him like a list of things he got to do. He got to pray. He got to make sure he eat healthy. He got to train six times a week. Like all this shit. Like he just like I don't know. And why everything got to be on the internet? And how come there's nobody around him that can could, that could check him? Like, this shit is crazy. I don't know. He said, you know, going into it, he's like, you know, I smoke, I drink. This is, all oh, this is before the rants on social media. But, you know, yeah. he smoke, he drinks. He's still the best. I don't know, man. I mean, I'm going to say this. I'm going to take all the whatever out of it. For the sake of boxing, like I always say, for the sake of boxing, I hope, I hope cuz is cool. I hope he's cool. I don't, want, I don't want to see nothing happen to him. I don't wish him no kind of harm. You know what I mean? I don't wish him no type of jail, or nothing, no type of bad situation. I hope he can come up out of it mentally and do the right thing and get ready to fight. You know what I mean? I want, I want to see that fight. And um, I, think, I think if it is somebody that could talk to him, talk to him, like really get with him. And, and, and really play his shadow, like be his shadow, like be with that dude every step of the way because he needs somebody healthy around him because obviously the people around him, they just egging it on, like they're not really helping, you know what I'm saying, if he's really going through something. Now if, he, now, if he just promoting it but using a different type of uh, mood to promote it, he doing a hell of a job because he got me convinced, you know what I mean? He got me convinced that something, something going on. People even calling me. They act like I got his number. They talking about, do you think he on drugs? Do you think he, he really smoked wet or something? I'm like, I don't know. What the fuck? Like, how do I know? I don't know what he do. You know what I mean? But I don't know. I hope cuz. All right, though.